No, I'm this. I'm sorry. It just like further proves my point. Like, <laughs> rock and roll is fucking dead. Like, <laughs> these white boys today are corny and cheesy. Oh, like, <laughs> no, for real. Where did all the where did all the cool white boys go? Like, what happened, to y'all? Like, no, for real. What happens? That is the most fucking flaccid dick castrated chihuahua fucking love letter bullshit no (laughs) no 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 but really what is this white male obsession with disrupting things why you wanna disrupt shit why you wanna make people upset all the time Hmm? and then get beat up afterwards why you wanna do that like why like why you don't wanna make people feel good like why you wanna why you wanna upset people? Why you wanna get under people's skin? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Do you need a parasite cleanse? Do you have <laughs> like are the worms crawling out of your ass and fucking itching around your butthole? Like bitch, why are you so fucking bothered? No, the whole disruptive culture of white men, eh no. You gotta get beat up. Don't do it. <laughs> And really, for all the slack that y'all gave Azealia Banks for talking or for having an opinion, these men, these days, these male artists are some fucking chatty motherfucking patties. No. No, first off. 1979 is garbage. That's first off. Second off, he's not even in character. You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to give just real mysterious, you know, like, deep in the lyrics, you're not supposed to have time to be all up in people's faces and doing all that and talking shit and worried about ice spice and all that. No, that's not that's, that's there's nothing fucking fly about that. I swear to God, like everybody just needs to be Carlos D from Interpol. Like <laughs> that's the coolest motherfucker of all time. If y'all niggas not like Carlos D, no, you no, no. I don't want my rock singers chatty and heroin needle and doing all that. But sidebar, like, I was just, I just like watching these little rap niggas. They be fighting, <laughs> they be beefing with each other. <laughs> they having slumber parties and like painting each other toenails and whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? Then they be beefing on the on the fucking <laughs> on the timeline with each other. And it's it's like, what are y'all what are y'all talking about? Like, what what are y'all talking about? Do y'all all know that y'all are all trash? And future is like better than everybody. Like and yeah, yeah, your your these little arguments about who's watching who and all that other shit. It doesn't matter when future, when we we have future. Cause none of y'all are fucking with future. Jay Z not even fucking with future. Sorry, future is really the best. Like future is the best. He's the best. No, 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 for real. Who's fucking with Future? Nobody's fucking with Future. Like, it just, like, no, I just had a eureka. Like, my fucking brain just exploded. Like, nobody in the world is fucking with Future. I can't name a rapper in history that's fucking with Future. I really think Future is... Future's definitely the best of all time. Because the real music heads, like, no, when you listen to his his melodies and shit, like, that nigga be singing tritones and all type of shit like that. Like, he's the jazz master. Future is, is the best. So I don't know why any of these little niggas are beefing. So the girls are fighting. Stop fighting. Okay, but guys, I'm very happy. I'm very, very fucking happy because, yes, everything is looking good, okay? Like, we can't do the DIY shit anymore. We cannot. So all the, all the dream boxes, well, not, not, the, not the dream boxes, all the what's the tea boxes, I'm just going to send you these ones because they just look good. I don't really want to send the ratchet tea, you know, like, I know y'all still, y'all would drink that fucking ratchet tea. But no, look how cute. Like, look how cute. 
La Chupa Rosa. Aw, it's the love tea. Get into it. It's the confidence tea. Oh, this is so no. These things are so sweet. I really love. I love doing this stuff. I know. I know a lot of you guys like process refunds. That's fine. But like, I there was just one day I was just like, okay, I've been doing this this company for how long? I need to just sit down, organize, get all the fucking stickers, logos, packaging, pop, 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 and pop it off for my kids, cause. Yeah, no. Even 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 if you you already got a refund, like you're still gonna get your order. Don't worry. You're still gonna get your fucking order. Let me not say that before y'all bitches go fucking like spam my shit. But I, either way, I don't care. I just needed to do this. But bitch, you didn't even get in. Get in to the window. Okay? Get into the window. Ah, no. I'm so happy. And I'm just so happy. I'm so proud of us, Kevin. I'm so proud of Comfortgate. Thank you guys for being so patient. Thank you guys for just fucking liking the little things that I like. And, you know, driving me to just make it more and more excellent more and more and more and more and more and more fucking excellent yes and yeah all these what's the tea boxes are coming with tea strainer um oh i gotta show you the stickers that are on the airline creams they finally look so like legit and they finally got a box on young rapunzel like oh <laughs> but bitch you didn't even get in get in to the window Okay, get into the window. Ah, uh, no. I'm so happy. And I'm just so happy. I'm so proud.